always see God in her life and how God is moving her uh, one place to another. Uh, she had one job and she left that job and she got her another job part time and then and she working overtime. <laughs> Amen. To let you know that God take care of his own. Yes. He does take care of his own. I don't care what nobody yes. says. Amen. He might put you somewhere just for a few minutes, amen. But he wants somebody to see who I got. This is mine. This belongs. She belongs to me. I want y'all to see her. Amen. So, uh, Pastor Hell, I love her like a sister. Amen. Let us say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise God for the angel of this house. Pastor Doris Johnson. Yes. Amen. We praise God for being here with you today. Amen. Amen. How many ready for the word? Yes. Amen. We praise God. Amen. I was up. You may be seated in his presence. Father, we thank you. We praise you. We magnify you for this day. God, I thank you right now, Father God, for imparting your word on this morning, Father. Lord God, that somebody may cry out, Father God, to you, Lord God. Father God, we thank you that there is no hope, Father God, but through you, God. And we thank you right now that let me decrease and you increase in this word. In Jesus' name, we call it done. Amen. 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 I was up till about 3 o'clock in the morning. Amen. We got home about 2. Amen. But the Lord, amen, laid this word on my heart this morning. I want you to get your Bibles together today, amen. Hallelujah. We're going to go as the Lord leads. The Lord yeah, led me yeah. today, hallelujah. Amen. I want you to get the book of Luke. We're going to begin at Luke 2, the 40, the second chapter of Luke, the 43rd through the 52nd verse. Amen. When you have it, say amen. Amen. The second chapter, the 43rd through the 52nd verse. Amen. And it reads. Does everybody have it? Amen. Amen. Luke 2. Luke the second chapter, the 43rd through the 52nd verse. And it reads. And when they had fulfilled the days as they returned... The child Jesus tarried behind in Jerusalem, and Joseph and his mother knew not of it. But they, supposing him to have been in the company, went a day's journey, and they sought him among their kinfolk and acquaintance. And when they found him not, they turned back again to Jerusalem, seeking him. And it came to pass that after three days, they found him in the temple, sitting in the midst of the doctors, both hearing them and asking them questions. And all that heard him were astonished at his understanding and answers. And when they saw him, they were amazed, and his mother said unto him, Son, why hast thou thus dealt with us? Behold the father, and behold, thy father and I have sought thee sorrowing. And he said unto them, How is it that ye sort me? Wouldst ye not that I must be about my father's business? And they understood not the sayings which he spake unto them. And he went down with them and came to Nazareth and, and was subject unto them. But his mother kept all these sayings in her heart. And Jesus increased in wisdom and stature and favor with God and men. Amen. Amen. If I should leave for you a topic this morning, I have access to God's favor. Amen. Look at somebody and say, I have access to God's favor. Whenever you watch TV or you got uh, these shows, you know they say an all access pass. An all access pass gets you through games, gets you through many things, amen. Well, that's what you have when you come in the presence of Jesus Christ, amen. Luke, this evangelist, this physician, one of Jesus' chosen 
people, anybody that followed Jesus had favor on their life. Hallelujah. And I just stopped by, hallelujah, to say to you this morning that you have access to God's favor. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. What is favor? Favor is blessing. Yeah. You know, when you get a badge and ID from your job, yeah. that gives you access to yeah. the benefits of that company. Yeah. Amen. Well, today I stopped by to tell you, amen, that when you follow Christ, amen, you enter into the favor of God. Hallelujah. You can see your life years ago and you can look at your life today, amen. If God don't pull some strings for you, amen, it ain't going to get done. Why? Because you have access to favor. Now, let me tell you about favor, amen. See, when Jesus began to take care of God's business, God began to move them into new destiny, new places. He began to travel. And that's what God wants you to understand this morning. That as you go his way, not your way, his way. Some people spend their whole life around dead ends. Yeah. People who talk negative, stupid, yeah. all day long. Yeah. You can have them. I'm not spending my 90, 80 to 90 percent of your time. Whatever you put in your spirit is going to become a part of you. That's what you're going to have access. You can either have access to favor or access to cursing. Right. Amen. And so when you spend your time around foolishness, yeah. around Things that are not going to get you ahead. Yes. Hallelujah. You release your access to favor. Amen. Now let me show you a few things about favor. You don't think you have favor on your life. Amen. If God didn't pull some strings, you wouldn't have the job you have now. All right. If God, if I didn't have favor with God, hallelujah. I was going around, hallelujah, just to give you my testimony. Last time I spoke, I said shift. Yeah. Right? right yeah. God shifted me. Yeah. So I'm speaking to you in a shifted, yeah. favored yeah. position. Right. Let me tell you what God did. Hallelujah. I was dealing with my conference. And my cousin know that's a lot of work. The conference, doing it in another state, God said, I want you to break into new territory. Right. Now you got to remember, I got a job. Yeah. I'm doing a conference in another state, and I got to move, and this demon next door is getting worse. Hallelujah. So God said, you take care of my business, and I'm going to give you the favor you need in your business. I'm going to give you access. Hallelujah. I'm one of the top producing people on my job. Hallelujah. Let me show you how favor works. Because it's not in one thing. Hallelujah. And so I was like, God, I don't know how you're going to do this. I'm working with a real estate agent. I'm working, hallelujah. Now, anybody know if you get an apartment in New York City in this day and time, you need between five and six thousand dollars because a dump is starting at a thousand dollars. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So if you don't have access to God's favor, if you don't believe God through sowing, seed time and harvest and say, Lord, I'm just going to do this for you so I can get access to this or that. Hallelujah. Don't fool yourself. Hallelujah. So I was doing my conference. Everything said, put your conference on hold. The natural man said, put your conference on hold. You need an apartment. But how many of you know you have blessings and things that you need to deal with at the same time. And so you can't just put God's business on hold. Hallelujah. You either believe or don't believe. So as I begin to do my conference, hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm doing my conference. I got to move. This demon banging, not getting any sleep, going to work. Hallelujah. I went to work one day. Working with a real estate agent. Keep that in mind. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Had to come up with five to six thousand dollars. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. God just went, came left field with favor. I'm at work one day. I don't know, I still don't know how the conversation came about. Hallelujah. Manager came to me and said, Are you still looking for an apartment? He didn't know, you know, I think I mentioned to him months ago, I didn't mention to him anything I was going through or whatever. Hallelujah. But he said, hallelujah, that he knows someone who is looking for a nice person to rent out in their, in their home. Hallelujah. So I didn't think nothing of it. I didn't even know God was going to move in that way. He said, go and see it. Blah, 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 blah. Long story short, 
I had so much favor with God. He just put the person, I said, God, I don't know how you're going to do it. Hallelujah. I had saved up money. Hallelujah. And even had to use some of that money for my conference, but I wasn't worried about it. I still had a chunk saved. Hallelujah. But even still, hallelujah, God moved and gave me access to favor through my manager. Hallelujah. And you know, the woman said to me, you know, hallelujah. She said, you be gone all day. You work. She said, you know, the reason why I chose you, let me tell you about faith. God working behind the scenes. Yes, she right. said your manager spoke so highly of you. Right. And this, this place had been vacant for a long time. Her daughter got married. Yes. Hallelujah. Her daughter got married and all her children are married. She don't want to be there by herself. Amen. But I'm just showing you yes. how God will give you favor. Hallelujah. My cousin know how I wasn't getting no sleep. Hallelujah. I don't know how to wake up now. <laughs> now it's too far. Listen, God, you bless me. But, but hey, I need a, a, a little, you know, but bless God. But I'm telling you about favor. God said this morning, hallelujah, get access to his favor through his word. Hallelujah. And Luke is a very familiar passage of scripture. But what I like about this last verse 52 it says and Jesus increased in wisdom yeah. and stature and favor with God. How many of you know shout favor? Yeah. Yeah. God is the yeah. only one that can give you favor. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Favor with God and I'm coming here and I stopped by here this morning to tell you that God is about to lose some favor yeah. on your life. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. But see what about God. You, this is very disturbing. Hallelujah. You know you got favor but there's going to be times God ain't going to show you how he coming in. Because like I said, hallelujah. When you got to leave somewhere at a certain time or you need some money and you don't see it, you be like well, God, I believe you is coming but I, I don't see it. You get a little shaky. I don't care who you are. You get a little shaky. Amen. Hallelujah. But God will come left feet. Yeah. Hallelujah. Somebody say let feel let and give feel. you access to somebody, a man or woman of God with favor. Yeah. And if you notice in the scripture, he said Jesus increased with favor with yeah. God and man. Yeah. Don't get it twisted. If you so unfriendly can't get along with nobody, yeah. you messing with your favor. That's right. That's right. Because it takes God to touch a woman or a man. Yeah. That's right. Heart for you to have faith. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. 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 Yeah. Hallelujah. This is the season for favor. This is the season for abundance. This is the season for rain. Hallelujah. Yeah. God is just going to give some of you favor. Yeah. Mother, hallelujah. I know you probably have to go. Huh? But I'm coming here this morning. Huh? God wants you to know this morning is that he's giving you access to his favor. Yeah. Hallelujah. He said hold on to his blessings. Yeah. Hold on to the gifts that he's given yeah. you. Hallelujah. And you are blessed and anointed with his favor. Yeah. Hallelujah. 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 You increase it. Hallelujah. With wisdom and favor with God and man. Hallelujah. God is going to bless you today. God is going to heal you today. God is going to touch you from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. Hallelujah. He said, I'll never leave you. He said, I'll never forsake you. He said, Lord, I'm with you. Even in the low high. Hallelujah. 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 It only takes God's favor. He said, favor. He said, favor. Hallelujah. Favor all over your life. Favor over your mind. Faith over your body. Hallelujah. God is with you. I don't care what the enemy's been saying. You live longer than most of us. 94 years old. God has favor on your life. Hallelujah. And God is going to do this thing for you. Hallelujah. God is going to bring you through this test. Hallelujah. 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 Favor. Hallelujah. Favor. Favor. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. You know, the Lord deals with each of us differently. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I hit it and quit it or keep on based on what he's saying to me. But the spirit of prophecy is upon me. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah. And I'm going to move and flow in his spirit this morning. Hallelujah. Shatik, hallelujah. The Lord showed me this morning. I was tired. Hallelujah. Shatik, I want you to stand. Hallelujah. The Lord said you have access 
to favor in the theater arts world. Yeah. Hallelujah. He said, begin to get your productions together. Hallelujah. I see you doing some major productions. You see, he gave you access to favor by putting you in plays first. By doing those now, he's giving you access to do your own. Hallelujah. I see you with your own production company. Hallelujah. In the future, he says, write the vision and make it plain. So when you read it, you're going to start running. You are already a runner. Hallelujah. When you like something, you're able to stick to it. Hallelujah. He said he's going to give this to you. Begin to get your own productions together. Thus saith the Lord. I wasn't even... I saw you briefly on the bus yesterday, but as I was getting dressed this morning, I saw it clearly. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Sometimes God give me a message while I'm getting dressed. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. And God said he is going to rain on you in this season. Hallelujah. Yeah. In the next three years, it's going to be crucial. Favor. Hallelujah. Yeah. You're going to be called to do a lot of things. Even your school is going to call you back. But some things, hallelujah, because you left a good impression on them. Yeah. Hallelujah. God has given you favor even now on this job. Yeah. Don't be surprised at management. Yeah. Yeah. See, you have access to favor through your mother's blessing as yeah. well. Yeah. You have your mother. You do different things. Hallelujah. Yeah. No matter how tired you are, yeah. you come to God's house. That's access to favor. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. People want to know, bless you. Hallelujah. God bless you, Shati. Hallelujah. Right now in the name of Jesus. But he had so much favor yes. when he was in New York. Yes. Hallelujah. He had so much favor. He had an Alexis at a young age when he was in New York. Yes. He had so much favor. He didn't have the education. Yes. But the bosses just like him because he's humble. Yes. I bring that up because of your humility. Yes. Yes. You are going to shoot to places where people who have master's degrees belong but because God has so favored your life because they're earning your job hallelujah you're gonna have more leeway more freedom because hallelujah this level next level anointing blessing that's on your life is going to take you on a traveling now you're going to tie it of course into your ministry but then there'll be weekends where you're going to be traveling months where you're going to be traveling more often than not. Hallelujah. 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 God is going to begin to expand the healing anointing that's on your ministry. Hallelujah. People are going to be coming because of the healing anointing all over your ministry. Hallelujah. We praise you. Hallelujah. 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 We thank you for your glory. Hallelujah. 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 Evangelist Hunt. Hallelujah. Hallelujah and Pastor Weathers. Hallelujah. God said he's begun a great work in you. Hallelujah. Yeah. Through this school, these women have so much knowledge and so much wisdom. And he's granting you more favor. Hallelujah. And in the future, you will both get together. Hallelujah. To, to, to do something uh, for kids, young adults. 
and adults, but it's more important that we start it. Amen. And the yes. wisdom that you yes. have yes. is going to, hallelujah, God made you a teacher for a reason. That's yes. your anointing. That's your gift. Yes. And God is to be going to begin, to begin to expand it because you have a gift also with kids. You have the gift to break things down. You have a gift also, Pastor Weathers. And as God begin to talk to you both, amen, he's about to enlarge what you begin. All right, man. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We praise God for them. I don't care how much you've been going into ministry. You need to study. Yes. Amen. You need to be more diverse in the word. Yes. Amen. And you need somebody who's able to teach you. Amen. That's These right. ladies. I mean, we can you can ask them any question. Yes. And to be honest with you, they can answer 99.9% yes. .9 of the questions. They're well rounded. And I thank God for them because yes. they teach you to be well rounded. Yes. They had when we first opened the course, they were talking about the different viewpoints. Well, you're gonna need that in this day and time yes. of ministry. There's so many different faiths in this New York City yes. area alone. Well, you're gonna need to know different points of view. Yes. And we thank God that God has given you access to favor. Yes. Favor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Pastor Weathers, God said he got favor yeah. on your skip, Mr. Holy. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. I just see you expanding. Yeah. I see yeah. this yeah. skit that you do. Hallelujah. Yeah. Expanding. God said, get it together. Hallelujah. As a play for. Now, this is the thing about God. There's two worlds. There's the secular, yeah. positive secular world. Yeah. And then there's the church world where you can teach kids. Yeah. Hallelujah. Just don't get so esoteric and block your blessing. Yeah. Okay? What I mean by that is that we have to deal with the world. As long as you're keeping it positive and you can do it the way you want to do it in your church world. You know, there's a thing called positive plays, just like black history plays or different yeah. things. Expand your vision. Hallelujah. Yeah. Because there's a great blessing. When you have access to schools, yeah. I did a play at Black Spectrum Theater. Oh yeah, they contract to teach uh, children. It was Black yeah. History Month play, The yeah. Magic Crown, yeah. but it yeah. teach children positive images Wonderful. through plays. Yeah, and we did that for I think a month. My job let me do it for a month. Wonderful. Every Wednesday at different schools. Yeah. And God said He's going to begin to give you favor. Yeah. Favor because you have a heart. Yes. You have a heart, hallelujah, to get our children to grow. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We call you the crusher. Hallelujah. All right. All right. <laughs> they little babies. Yes. Let them take it. The, they kindergarten. Take their time. First grade. Mm -hmm. When you see somebody who graduated. Okay, but God is going to favor you with I just love that skit that you did and I just see it expanding 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 hallelujah hallelujah now how many know when you uh, Bless and God give you a word of wisdom hallelujah. He don't want you to say everything Amen. he wants you to use wisdom yes. wisdom